newest man who served in the Marines during the Vietnam War is this week's hometown hero. KPLC's John Bridges tells us this Purple Heart recipient took part in one of the war's most deadly battles. Ed Deal signed up for the U.S. Marines right out of high school. Weeks later, he found himself in the DMZ between North and South Vietnam. His unit was helping the Army in what is known as the Battle of Hamburger Hill. The unit I was in, we ended up over there, so we, we went in there and helped, but we wasn't supposed to be there. But we did. There was 400, 400 people started on that hill and 50 of, them walked, 50 of us walked away from it, so... It was tough. While rescuing another soldier on the hill, Deal was shot in the stomach and later received a Purple Heart. After 13 months, he headed home to the U.S. When I got on the plane, I had to wear civilian clothes. And, and the whole time on the flight, when I got home, I didn't say anything about being in the military or nothing because they hated us. Everybody hated us. Ed found talking about his ordeal with other soldiers helped him deal with PTSD. It lifted a whole lot of that off my shoulders. And I thought, I thought well, there's, my, there's my therapy right there. Talk about it just a little bit. I don't talk about it right now, but I did then, you know. But that helped my, ther my, my therapy a little bit. This week, Ed was presented a quilt of valor by the Calcasieu Cut-Ups Guild for his service in the Vietnam War and promoting patriotism in schools. You talk to a lot of kids today, they don't even know anything about history. You know, so, so you got to try to teach them something. You got to try to teach them about, about the military that actually that's why you free and can, and can play on that phone right now because of us. In Gillis, John Bridges, 7 News. To do that. Deal later worked in law enforcement and served with the Ward 3 Marshal's Office.